Sweaty Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 and today's Manga Nerdigan Live Reaction video is going to be for One Piece chapter 861. And last chapter, we were just about to start the tea party and we met the seven emperors of the underworld, which, damn, they were scary as it is. But then, right before that, we met... Um, we met um, the second son of the Charlotte family, Katakuri, who looks like a fucking badass. He, and he has over a billion berry bounty to boot. And the thing is, is with him, and I'm curious who he's going to fight, because with his observation hockey, um, hockey um, he could slightly see into the future. So it's going to be interesting who he's going to fight. But anyway, without further ado, let's get to this chapter where the tea party is going to start. Oh my god, we're finally here. The tea party is going to goddamn start. And this chapter is called The um, Consummate Actor. It's all leading up to this. Atop the staircase of candy lies? Dude, I want that candy. Uh, dude, I want to go on there so bad. Whole cake chateau roof. Holy crap. Vito, what are you doing? Father, this is unbelievable. Just now, the president of the World Economic Times and the head of Germa were talking, uh, Raro. Hmm. Of course they'll talk. They've got ears and mouths on their heads, haven't they? Well, all I know is that this party is on a complete different level. The eldest son and the minister of candy, um, uh, Persepar... Prosopero and the eldest daughter of the Minister of Fruits, um, Compote. Wait, Capote. Oh no, it's com Compote. Whatever. Uh, the second uh, son, Commander Dogtooth. The fourteenth daughter, Commander Smoothie. Uh, the third son, uh, Daifuku. And the fourth son, Oven. I could barely keep track of the number of monsters here. Holy shit. I got a feeling that um, uh, the different people that were just named, like the different sons and the daughters... I got a feeling those are the people that we're going to be fighting uh, throughout um, the tea party. That's just my just my thought. Here, I'm curious what you nerdigans think about that. I mean, it was nice having these guys on our side, reassuring even, but just thinking about making enemies out of all of them sends shivers down my spine, Rero. Hmm? Enemies? Step. Step. Mama. Oh, it's Mother Carmel. That picture is the key. Indeed, our mother. Ah, I'm so glad to see uh, mother smiling so brightly today. I still don't even know who she is, but ha ha ha, mama, mama, mama. Yes, mother is the light of this world. This is my first time at one of your tea parties, so I was just wondering, how exactly is this person related to you, big mom? Do not presume to trespass upon my memories. Woo! Yeah, there's some a bad relationship there with 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 uh, Mama and uh, and Mama Carmel. Y yeah, there's got to be something there, an abusive relationship or something. Now, 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 leave all that alone. Uh, look, we brought you presents, Charlotte, um, and some for your daughter in honor of her wedding today. Oh, treasure treasure chest, my favorite. Um, what is hiding inside? I wonder. I brought some uh, Lin Lin. Please accept mine as well. Mine are rare gifts from the South. I've shipped my um, own as well from the furthest uh, reaches of the North. I'm positively elated. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for all this. Thank you indeed. I'm so happy. Speaking of treasure chests, I heard you recently um, obtained the great treasure of the seafloor recently. Oh, news does reach your ears quite... Um, Quickly, Morgans, indeed I did. The treasure chest uh, passed down in the royal lineage of the deep from generation to generation. Oh my god, I forgot that that chest is there. And the, oh my god, this tea party is going to start off with a bomb. Oh my fucking god. Remember, it big, I wonder if they all remember, especially Jinbei. I wonder if Jinbei, um... I, I don't remember if Jim Mabe knows or not or, uh, about the bomb. 
I don't think they even know about the bomb. Holy fucking shit. Oh my god, there's a bomb. Oh my god. I almost, the bomb's gonna go off. Oh my god. And for some reason, I cannot fathom Neptune has willingly parted with it, and now it rests here with me. This is the treasure uh, chest of legends itself, the Tame de Baco. Ooh, what, um, Gravitas, what presents? I wonder what in the world is inside. A bomb is inside. <laughs> Along with all the other presents I have received, I will open this. Oh no, during the grand banquet after putting ceremony. You will all get to see what is inside. Oh no, she said she's gonna open it after the after the fucking um ceremony. Oh man. So even if Big Mom doesn't die and something tell like that that treasure chest is gonna be open. If like Big Mom doesn't die, which she's gonna die, she will die at some point. Um if Maybe this is a, uh, just a foreshadowing of Voto Senpai saying, Big Mom ain't gonna die, and she's gonna get the bomb after uh, everyone escapes. <laughs> oh my god! I can't wait. Oh my god, I can't wait to see this bomb. Um, Father, oh, done already? The preliminary, preliminary uh, preparations went off without a hitch. What's the state of affairs downstairs? The cooks are uh, currently partying... Um, at the banquet before uh, being held to commemorate the end of the culinary preparations. We sealed off all the corridors on our way up here. If we lock this door up tight, no one should be able to make it up here for the time being. We've also placed a uh, horn Denden Mushi to block radio transmission. The wedding hall is completely isolated. Good. Well done. Go change. Roger. Caesar, get the mirror out. Knock, knock. Um, damn it, you, oh, stop calling me that. <laughs> So, this is going to be your entrance into the tea party. Well, try to enjoy yourselves, scum of the earth. Shoro, uh, shoro, You're pretty scummy yourself. You, um, you know, any, anyway, go hide the mirror somewhere over there quickly. Oh, so the grand entrance is going to be in the mirror, through the mirrors. Oh, that's so sneaky. That is sneaky as hell. Your job is to grab that mirror and fly into the hall as soon as you hear Big Mom cry out in her strange voice. Uh, that thing is our um, one and only exit out of here. You better hope that Big Mom's uh, stra um, strange voice, that horrible scream, isn't going to break the fucking mirror. I, I hope they thought about that. Um, that thing is our uh, one and only uh, exit out of here. Try not to get any wild ideas. I'm not going to betray you now of all times. <laughs> Caesar Clown? Oh, Oh no, Beige and the others are definitely planning something. Uh-oh. Oh, Beige glared at that door. That door is scared. That door is scared. I got a feeling that the thing with the picture of Mama Carmel, it's kind of is making me think of a Horcrux. And for those Nerdigans that don't know what a Horcrux is and have not read Harry Potter or watched the movies, just... Uh, if you don't only really watch the movies of Harry Potter and not read the book, shame on you. I'm going to give you the shame. I got a feeling that the, um, that the Mama Carmel picture is a horcrux. It would just make complete sense. Because if you remember, I'm going to spoil Harry Potter, if, just in case uh, you nerdigans haven't read it, deal with it. Because if you, um, you remember when uh, the, um, every time a horcrux was destroyed... Voldemort, like, especially um, when it was closer to the last uh, Horcrux, or um, you would hear Voldemort, like, doing the scream. So, I'm curious what you Nerdigans think about that. Do you Nerdigans think that the picture is kind of like a Horcrux where, um, what I mean is that uh, Big Mom put a piece of her soul into the picture, that's what I'm thinking. It would make a whole lot of sense if, because remember what Beige said about the picture frame being, um, about something happening to the picture and she, and Big Mom was screaming in pain. It would make complete sense. Anyway, I wanted to make sure I got that thought out there. Well, I 
remembered it. Anyway, I whittled her down a notch or two. Loose lips uh, sink ships. <laughs> and remember, snitches get stitches. We've got around, uh, we've got about 30 minutes before the ceremony starts. Are the straw hats ready to go? Take a look for yourself. Um, in, they're inside your own body after all, aren't they? Oi, idiots. What the hell are you doing sleeping? <laughs> they're all fucking sleeping. What about the preparations? Let them rest. They ha um, have barely had the chance to sit down since they got here. I'll wake them uh, 10 minutes before it all begins. Something's wrong with you lot. If you end up being a burden, I'll cut you all um, loose, then, loose then and there. Stop worrying. I will take care of the preparations and will also keep watch. Those bastards, I'm actually shocked, right? Get back in there. I'll walk into the hall myself. Get ready, you lot. After I step foot inside there, there's no going back. Ninth floor, bride and groom's uh, room. I, I, I had no intention of marrying when I arrived here, but the fact that I'm sitting here next to you is so strange. I almost feel as if I'm in a dream. Well, is that, a, is that dream a good one or a bad one? This is so cute. Don't, Sanji. Don't fall apart now. Uh, of course, a good one. Really? I'm glad. Keep it together, Sanji. She's just action. She's just acting. She's tr actually trying to kill me. Wait, maybe, maybe I really was just dreaming all the other stuff. No, 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 no. Don't fall for it. Trust in your own memories. Sanji, what's wrong? Uh, um, nothing. I, uh, oh yeah. Um, our big kiss, well, if you're, well, if you don't want to do in front of everyone and all, I'll be, um, okay with kissing your forehead, uh, on the, um, your forehead or something, or somewhere else, you know, I mean, kiss, um, me on the mouth, silly. We're going to be husband and wife, aren't we? Sanji, no, no, Sanji, don't fall for it, no! Crash, oi, what the hell was that noise? Lord Sanji crashed into the wall, the wall? He's bleeding like mad. Oh no, Sanji! Uh, the hell is with this pervert? I want to kill him right now. Damn bitch. Here we go. Look, the party has begun. Look at that. The party has begun. Oh, now, um, then, friends and guests, our main event. The 35th daughter of the Charlotte family, Charlotte Pudding, and the uh, third son of the Vinsmoke, uh, family, Vinsmoke Sanji, let their royal wedding begin. Oh, and the, um, oh, the pirate crew of, uh, the Yonko Big Mom and the armies of the evil, armies of evil of the Germa 66. Beautiful. This young couple, uh, will connect the dreams of, of, uh, these two dastardly families together. He, <laughs> A, mar a marriage de vision, as these two are united as one, once again will uh, the flowers of villainy bloom wildly across the land. Applaud, applaud the dizzy, dizzy beauty of this day. The ceremony starts, there's no going back now. Applaud, that bastard, he's getting way too into his acting role. The blood-drenched wedding begins now. Next week we get the wedding. Oh my god. 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 This is it. What we've all been waiting for is happening next week. I swear to god though, Sanji. Just, ah, oh, Sanji. Blah. Blah. But I can't believe I almost forgot about that freaking bomb. Like, I'm just curious what you nerdigans think. Do you think that bomb from uh, Fishman Island is going to come into play during the tea party? Or do you think it's going to come into play after afterwards? Like, I, I just have a feeling it's going to come. Like, if Big Mom doesn't die, if she doesn't die, the bomb's going to come into play afterwards. Like, I just have a feeling that uh, that bomb has got to come into play. That bomb has to come into play at some point. Um, I can't believe I almost forgot about that shit. Um, and what do you think about that Horcrux theory of, uh, the Mama Carmel picture? And what do you think about that past with Mama Carmel? Like, what did Mama Carmel do to, to, um, to Big Mom that traumatized her so badly? Like, I'm so curious what she did. Like, I really, really am. Anyways... Let me know your thoughts um, on this chapter. Are you guys excited? We're going to get, like, what do you think about the strategy, too, about 
pop uh, the entrance going through the mirror. Like uh, the just the thing that I keep thinking of is like, don't you think that the scream is going to break it? <laughs> Oh my god, I'm so excited. I got a feeling if the bomb comes into play, Jinbei's gonna be the one to release it. I, I just have that feeling. I really do. Because I, I think Jinbei knows about the bomb, if I remember correctly. If Jinbei knows about the bomb like I think he does... Oh boy! <laughs> Jinbei will be the one to, to unleash the bomb. I, I just have that feeling. I just got a feeling. Or like in the midst of the scuffle... Uh, that's going on, the bomb's gonna go off. But I'm curious, like, who do you think's gonna fight the kids? Uh, the main kids? Because that's gonna happen. That's, because uh, the kids that were highlighted, those are gonna be our main fights that's gonna happen in the next chapter or next couple of chapters. But anyway, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. if you love what I'm doing and want to contribute to the um, Nerdigans Inc. expansion, there is a few ways you can do that. You could donate to the Nerdigans Inc. PayPal, Patreon, or purchase something off the Nerdigans Inc. Amazon wish list. All those links are in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on the Twits, aka Twitter, follow my Twitch channel, and find me on PlayStation Network. All that's in the description box below as well. And until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye!